Man, it was a thrill like no other pulling in on the bus. And it's all fogged up and it's got this music blaring and my fans are cheering and I felt like a rock star. I'm gonna say going to my hometown was my favorite. My pride. Because you don't realize how much people care about other people. You might think you might be the only one that cares sometimes. And this was a big honor. My town is my family and I love it. Uh, America theme. I loved that. It was so fun. Everyone looked so good. It was like the, the lights were so bright. You couldn't see anything around you and you were just in your own little world. Honestly, I'm so competitive. I love games. I love anything that, I don't know, I like the skill of games. Like, not the luck games, like someone calls in. I like the stuff that we actually had to do ourselves. My favorite part was the game nights at night, getting to have a big blast talking to our, uh, talking to our, uh, fans all over the nation and sometimes in other countries. I'm in the car and it's our first night. Man, I don't even know if I blinked. I didn't get any sleep. It was the longest day of my life. And then that night I had to eat a uh, rotten fish jelly bean. <laughs> so that first day was a, was a pretty rough one. Nobody's bad, nobody nothing, but I just felt like we had the personality clashes at times. That was my hardest part. Staying in that car and not falling asleep. Because it's so, you have to keep interacting with that thing. And very first night, Sunday night, when I wanted to punch throat Gary because he would not let me go to sleep. And every time I would lay my head down, I'd start dozing off. It's like three or four in the morning. And he'd say, oh no, Megan, oh no. It ain't happening and you ain't going to sleep. The hardest part was the first night. I struggled, I'm 6'3". Car is not meant for me to sleep in the back seat. Yeah, I slept like an hour and a half the first night. And that daggum sour milk jelly bean that I ate, that was rough too. That's a rough question, Cody. I'm not going to pick one. I'd have to pick two of them. Uh, Will and I are almost family. And Megan, you know, I've come to know her family and her husband and her son. And, you know, uh, I had to flip a coin between those two. I do like Will because he needs it the most, I think. Everybody else has their jobs, they're all set in Will. He's in college just like me, so I understand. That is really hard to choose. I would probably say Gary, though. Just, I have really um, bonded with Gary, and we have a lot in common, and I think that he'll be a lifelong friend. And that's a tough, that's a tough um, hit. Um, I have grown to be friends and love everyone in that car, and everybody's got a pretty good reason to have it. Man, I just, if I had to give it to one, just because Alyssa just had a wreck and wrecked her grandma's car, just kind of put her in a bind, and she's going to school, and I know how that is. It's a struggle to pay for college and have a car and all those kind of things. I think I'd have to give it to Alyssa if I had to give it to somebody. Alyssa, I would sure give it to her. She is uh, very real, true, and uh, she's just cute as a button. I think that uh, First Bank and its staff was phenomenal. <sighs> and I've had a lot of fun, it's been fun. This has honestly been one of the best weeks of my life. I was gonna say it was just a fun week, fun field, uh, action packed, uh, highs and lows. It's a week I'll never forget in my life, and I, I'm glad I got the opportunity to do it. I've made some great friends. I have got to meet some very unique people throughout it, and um, I have bonded with these people in the car. It's been an overall awesome experience, and I regret nothing. That the first bank um, went over and above in serving us and serving the community in, by doing it. I can, without a doubt, even before I, I left our bank, but now I can say, First bank, there's none like it.